Hey guys, we're going to be following Tirsa around today. She's been finding some larva in her zone and there's been a lot of rain. Um, she's been doing really well, but she's still a seasonal, so we want to get out there and, and make sure everything's going well and see what we find. Should be interesting. We'll see you out there. Hey guys, we're out here with Tirsa today and as you can see the roads are really muddy so we're going to have to park the trucks here and, and walk it. So what's the plan today Tirsa, what are we checking? Uh, we are heading over to the Tito, to Tino Marsh area, um, just right up the ways and we're going to dip and see if there's any larva. Alright, let's do it. Okay. Hey guys, so it was a long walk, but we got here. We're at the beginning of Totino Marsh, and really this is a new area for us. Uh, this is gonna be the first full season that we're seeing it in action and seeing kind of uh, what it produces. So Tirsa, what have you been finding out here? So I mostly have been finding, um, I haven't been here often, but when I am here, I've checked this grassy area. I actually found larva here. Um, basically, that's the only place I found larva where there's vegetation. Uh, most of the the inside of this new marsh is very bare. They're barely planting plants on the on the little hillside. But besides that, it's just so new, it's gonna be nice to be able to explore more of it. Yeah, definitely. All right, let's see what we find. So in this area, we actually have two more sources. We have the lower trestle, which would be to the left of those train tracks beyond here. And then mostly to the left of that, that you see right in front of you is going to be the trestle. Um, these areas, this specific area actually for Titino Marsh, it's fed by rainwater, agricultural runoff, and also they have been began filtering water from the Moro Coho into this area. Um, then it goes and runs back out into the Morocco after that. So now that we've checked this area, we are going to head over to the PG and wetlands um, towards that way and see what we find over there. All right, guys, Paul just got done showing tears to the pg &E wetland. What'd you think? It was pretty interesting. Pretty yeah. interesting, a little bit different than some of the other sources around here, or more yeah. or less the same? Um, a little different, uh, a lot more a lot more diverse, it seems. Kind of reminds me of the sewer ponds, just because you have cooling and filtering and all that. But we haven't found anything, so who knows what will happen in the future. All right, good deal. Well, that'll do it for this video. We'll see you guys next time. Have fun. This has been a while. Oh man. Hey guys, we're following Tirsa around today. We're gonna to be out in her zone with her today. She's got, uh, I don't need to repeat twice that we're gonna be out there with her. <laughs> Dang man. Hey guys. <laughs> Forgot my dipper, so I made a dipper. All right guys, that'll do it for this video. Thanks. Come on bro, give a little bit better of a...